We continue to hear from members of our local congressional delegations who were in the House chamber when rioters stormed the Capitol. Pennsylvania Congresswoman Susan Wilde gave her eyewitness account to CBS Evening News anchor Nora O'Donnell. I was seated in the House gallery um, while the Arizona objectors were being heard. Uh, as a member of the Pennsylvania delegation, we were scheduled to have our objections and responses heard next. I was planning to speak during that, so I was just up in the gallery waiting. We were all on pretty high alert because we were aware of the protests outside, and things started to get very, very um, ramped up. At one point, um, there was commotion out in the hallway outside of the gallery. And the Capitol Police came in and started locking us in, barricading the doors. Um, obviously, that was a very frightening, intense situation. The Speaker of the House and a few others in leadership were removed from the House floor. Somebody came, I think somebody from the Sergeant at Arms team over the microphone and told people to look under their chairs for gas masks that were in heat. Um, under there, which we did, um, and then at one, we were told to sit and be quiet for a long time. I don't have any concept of how long, and then suddenly we were told to evacuate. And because of where I was in the gallery, we could only evacuate through one door, which was clear on the other side of the house floor. Um, and so I and about 15 or 20 other members were among the last and then all of a sudden, they wouldn't let us evacuate anymore. They, they barricaded the doors and said there, was, there were intruders again in the hallway. And the next thing I knew, was the, there was glass breaking and shots being fired, and we were told to get down. Frightening, intense, and unbelievable day.